a glory hole if I've ever seen one. Kasiak back again with another video and today we're going to be playing Baldur's Gate 3. This is part three. Where we left off was at the entrance of a really gross scene, I guess. Hopefully we'll get to have a lot more combat and things like that today. Let's jump into the game. So we explored around the map a little bit and now I'm assuming that this is the only way through. So we probably want to approach with care. Because surely there is creatures in here. So we've got an intellect devourer. Apparently it's 12 out of 15. Can I hit it by a surprise? Eldritch Brast is a good cantrip. Sure, let's try. Ooh, okay, so now we're rolling for initiative. Range attacks from above are more likely to hit, while range attacks from below hit less, less often. So... It's hard to tell what is above and what is below in this kind of map. Better stay back. So... Should... No, that I uh, would need to disengage, which is not my action here. So, can I do anything for my bonus action? I can only shove them pretty much. All my spells are out. So, I might just shove this one away. Let's see, let's roll. Oh, we got a successful roll. Now I can move back and that's not an attack of opportunity for them now so i think we've got shared initiative so um let's go firebolt oh should i get rid of that one or damage this one a little bit let's try and get rid of this one hope that it hits and it does. Excellent. So I'm gonna move her shadow heart back a little bit and then end the turn. Okay, let's see what they do. <gasps> Wait. Attack of opportunity? Eldritch Blast, is that going to be... Oh, I'm at a disadvantage because it's close. 1d4 plus 1 piercing damage. 1d4 plus 1, 2 to 5, 2 to 5. This is the same. Okay, let's do this. And... Oh, critical miss! Are you serious? Oh, man. Okay, I'm gonna <laughs> shove it away again then. So I basically got a free turn then because it provoked an attack of opportunity. It's at a disadvantage, that's not good. Okay, so we'll just use a melee attack then. At least there's that, and we can shove them back. Oh, athletics failed. I probably should have <laughs> used the bonus action to heal her. Oh well, we live and we learn. Hopefully we don't kill Shadowheart. Ah, uh, she's dead. Just gotta not die. Oh my god. Um... I might use my Hellish Rebuke as a reaction. General, if a member of the Witcher Zero, they're downed. Okay, so basically, yeah, I have to revive her as a as an action. But I think instead, 
I do I still have my action? Oh, that's at a disadvantage. Um, all of my these things are going to be at a disadvantage. Maybe I'll try using piercing strike and yes okay cool and because i've got dark ones blessing get an extra four hit points but i think because i already had it from before i still keep that and she's stabilized so can i help her i used the help action and now she's okay and now she's going to have a healing potion nine out of ten hit points which is Probably all right. We can probably proceed with that. Oh yeah, we should probably loot this. What have we got? Intellect Devourer Cerebellum. Combine three of these to create a suspension. Potion Elixir of Psychic Resistance. Oh, okay. That could be interesting. Okay. So we had only one of them? Oh no, here's the other one. I've got nothing. There's another one over here. Empty. So I'm holding down the alt key to show uh, where stuff is. Okay, so hopefully we can proceed with caution through here. Another step forward. Need like a sneak action. Let me get into this chest. Oh, okay, so I guess this is up. What's this? An oil of accuracy. Coat your weapon to receive plus two bonus to attack rolls with oil weapon. Oh, that's cool. Wish I had that before. And there's a dead mind flayer here. And he's got potion of speed. Okay, and a void bulb. I wonder how much backpack space we have. <laughs> um, let's go up here. I see another dead mind flayer. I got a potion of healing, a skull, and a spiked bulb. Oh, okay, so that's like a bomb for nearby creatures. That's interesting. And I saw someone down here somewhere. Where were they? Here. Ooh, uh, gold. Silver locket. That looks good for selling. 51 gold. That seems like a lot. Rapier. Not proficient with... Martial weapons or rapiers, so I can't equip that. Purple grapes, camp supplies. Or I guess the question is, do we keep going up in there? I think the other side over here is just like more land. I think this is the way to get. To keep going. I think our main goal here is to get inside the camp. And I think this is the way we have to go to get in. Just guessing, really. And I hope there's no other scary things that are going to come out of nowhere. Might as well take a look. Potion of speed, another void bulb. I guess Shadowheart can take them. Let's get going. And I'll take back over the lead. I just know that, can we press M or something to go to the map? Journal, map, ping. So this over here, this door is where we need to end up. So we kind of need to keep going in this general direction, north. Footprints. 
Right, so footprints. Sounds like what the heck is this? Dead goblins over there. Dead Got goblins over there. Slide, maybe. Over there. Goblins? I mean, I saw they were imps, but goblins seems like a weird thing. <laughs> Potions of healing. They've got a bone. Goblin scimitar. Not proficient with martial weapons or scimitars. I wonder if Shadowheart could Whatever take it. Takes. Nah, not proficient. Hmm. Oh. I was trying to use Sims controls then to like click on my own character, right mouse click. <laughs> Supply pack and a goblin bow. Does less damage, so you'll probably sell that. Although, what does Shadowheart have? What's her bow like? Oh, she doesn't have a bow. Well, okay. So she'll take that, I guess. And so then we can equip her ranged. She's only got two health potions. I have five. Can I <sighs> send to Shadow Hut? I might split the item to and then send to Shadow Hut. And then Shadow Hut has four. Awesome. Need to split that acro right. evenly across the party. We don't want someone to not have life. Swift as my feet can carry me. <laughs> Swift as my feet can carry me. Yes, it is. It does look like an unstable room, for sure. Let's investigate. <laughs> we'll start a conversation. Approach the sigil on the stone. Magic glitters and swirls from it erratically, as if malfunctioning. It looks slightly dangerous. It looks slightly dangerous. Yeah, no shit. No shit. Touch the sigil. So it looks dangerous. Touch it. Should we touch it or should we leave? I'm going to touch it. Oh, it zapped me. <laughs> Glare at it. Oh. A hand? Anyone? Who the heck? What the heck? That's. <laughs> it's a glory hole if I've ever seen one. Mm. Who are you? <laughs> Slap the hand. And what kind of character is this? To be honest, what kind of character is this? Tune yourself to the sigil's magic and then bid it to quiet, quiet down. <laughs> it's far too dangerous to leave him. Grab the hand and pull. Mm. I feel like I'm gonna do this one, grab the hand and pull. Now, we've got a roll higher than a seven. And I have minus one. Can I get, yes, I will get guidance from Shadowheart. So hopefully we will be able to roll this. Good. Nine plus one, min yeah, it's nine. <laughs> Great. That's it. Go on. Keep pulling. It wasn't a critical success, it was just a normal success. Oh. Hello, Gail. How did you get sucked into the void? 
Hello. I'm Gale of Waterdeep. Apologies. I'm usually better at this. <laughs> uh. uh at introductions. And magic. Say, but I know you, don't I? In a manner of speaking. You were on the Nors Lloyd as well. Was I? I don't know what transpired exactly, but the ship broke into pieces and I suddenly found myself in freefall. As I was plummeting Wait. to certain death, I spied a Nutaloid, is that what I the snail is called? Body to impact with less than savory propulsion. <laughs> Recognizing this glimmer to be magical in nature, I reached out to it with a weaving of words and found myself on the other side, as it were. How about you? <gasps> he doesn't you the look sure. <laughs> uh, should we be honest? Yeah, we'll be honest. But even so, I have the unfortunate suspicion your survival is still very much in jeopardy. Back on the ship, you two were on the receiving end of a rather unwelcome insertion in the ocular region. Were you not? Yes. Unwelcome insertion in the ocular region. That's no, much more there. pleasant than what the actual events the was. The we speak of, this parasite. Are you aware that after a period of excruciating gestation, it will turn us into mind flayers? Ew. I don't want to turn into one of them octopus. Ceramorphosis, and let me assure you, it is to be avoided. Well, we knew that already, Captain you Obvious. You don't be a cleric by any chance, do you? A doctor? Sir, Isn't Shadow hard a cleric? With a you seem to know enough about our condition to realize it's beyond most clerics' skills. Yeah, she is a cleric. So she's like, I'm a cleric, no but, but I find myself open to not my skill set. You. you don't happen to be one of them. I'm gonna use my warlock thing. I need to like flaunt care. my warlock. It's not exactly a common affliction. We're most certainly going to need a healer, and soon too. How about we lend each other a helping hand once more and look for a healer together? Are we really gonna have to have him on our team as well? Oh. He seems like a fun character. Fine. Most excellent. Parasite shared is a parasite halved. A parasite shared is a parasite halved. Same. Oh, but before you think you're about to embark on a journey with most ill-mannered a man, thank you for pulling me out of that stone. It was an act of foresighted kindness, I assure you. I have the feeling ample opportunities will present themselves for me to return. He doesn't seem like a very good mage if he got himself stuck inside his rune. Drag the portraits apart to split the party. Oh, interesting. Okay. So. Ooh, I still have guidance for a little bit. So I guess we will keep going this way. Rogues something, that's all. So Mushroom. Oh, okay. Recipe unlocked. Except I don't know where it went. Okay, we're at the chapel entrance. Um, okay, so my guidance has stopped. So we're at the other side of that. But we're on top of it, so... I don't understand how we get inside then. Oh, I've 
discovered something. The dirt mound. You sticking with my bare hands? No, of course not. What are you gonna dig with? I need a shovel to dig this up. A shovel? Oh, this is to sit on the bench? <laughs> I need a shovel. I'll sit down while Direct me. you can No hope of clearing this without a shovel. Okay. There is work to do. Who, no one has a shovel. A shovel to dig this up. Okay, I think we need to find a shovel somewhere. No. Never mind. Should find my step. I feel like I need to do like an investigation check on oh, this. Some people up here. Okay, they don't appear to be um, hostile. I don't think. You both twice as tall as me, but have half the bloody backbone. Oh goodness! We don't know what that thing even is. And what about the crypt? I'm telling you, it's a ship, and the crypt can wait. Mari and Barton have been trying to break in for days. Now we stop. <laughs> Got ourselves competition already. That's our ship. Persuasion. That ship is full of monsters. I wouldn't go near a deception. I think that ship's an invasion force. Run while you can. Intimidation. The only thing you own is your life. Leave before I take that too. I have intimidation proficient proficiency. Warlock, that ship's full of poisonous vapors, probably demonic, I'd stay away. Mm, let's go persuasion. And we'll get <laughs> guidance. It's a cantrip, so Shadowheart can use guidance as many times as she goddamn likes. Ooh, lucky we got plus three and plus two. So that's pretty good. Well, uh, in that case, come on, you lot. No point in getting oh, killed. Oh, Gale Second worm approved. gets the cheese and all. Um, second mouse gets the cheese. No? Oh. Nobody's getting any <laughs> damn cheese. Now move it. Second mouse gets the cheese because the first one dies. You're more cunning than you look. I thought we had a fight on our hands. Yeah, I'm smart. They ran really quickly. How do you, how do you run? Okay, so we need to find a shovel somewhere. Backpack, fill that here? sack. Uh, torch, not a shovel. Rope, dagger, thieves tools. Hey, we need that to get in the door. Yes, do I? Am I overweight? No. Okay. Interesting. Alright, and then we got... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay. Whoops. Backpack. Nothing in it. Alright. No more guidance. Okay, this door is locked. Everything all right out there? Ooh, should I do deception? Yeah, let's do deception. Because I don't think I have good performance. Let's do this. We're going to add guidance, of course. Okay, let's roll. Let's hope for 27. Lucky we got those bonuses because, woo, scary. Get inside and I'll wash off some bandages. Ah, that that look of, haha. Who the hell? You're dead. Oh, we've already rolled initiative. Commence battle. Surprised. 
Your enemy is surprised. Now, what can this guy do? Witch Bolt, Thunder Wave. Ooh, Thunder Wave is good. Um, mm, mm, Ray of Frost. Uh, let's go Witch. Oh, it's a disadvantage. Hmm. Okay, we'll use shove and then use that's still a disadvantage. Let's move back a bit and then try. There we go. We've got a 65% at least. Situational actions. You've unlocked actions as a result of another ability of history. It will remain inside of your hotbar until the conditions expire. What's that? And then... That's that's it. That's all he can do. Never a dull moment. And I will Eldritch Blast. Oh, I missed Eldritch Blast? Are you kidding? All right, and we will try to fireball. I think missed. Ah. Okay. Hmm. Who? He'll probably attack him first. We'll break guidance on me, and we'll put shield of faith on him. And then turn. So he's still surprised. Oh, he's just gonna dash and run away. Okay. Pawn to cleric four. And we will use Thunderbolt again. Because why not? This is gonna be tricky. Breathe deep. And I mean, should we be fully killing this guy? I'm not sure. Oh, we missed. Alright. And we are going to come here. And we are we're gonna use a ranged attack, because why not? There we go. Perhaps our survival isn't such a distant prospect. Darkness. Use a light source like a torch to see in the dark. Creature with dark vision don't need external light. Source. Light spell. End of the day. Something I didn't get to read that. I think all we all have dark vision. Except for this guy, probably. I'm not sure. Good here. I, hope. I don't know whether we should have killed him. He's got a key, bottle, leather armor. He's got a torch and a short sword. So there's another locked door there. Anything it's a wooden else? crate over here. No more prayers. Only dust. What have we got? A plate and bowl. Okay, we probably don't need no, those. Normally, the patron god is obvious. Not here. Um, table. Well, let's have a look at the clock. Ancient, indecipherable text covers the plaque. Well, that's helpful. Whoever worshipped here must be long gone. Right, okay. Chairs. Cheese wedge. A quill. I don't know, maybe we'll need that later. Where's my cheese? Always room for more. Supply pack. Take the cheese. <laughs> and this cheese. Interesting, interesting. Okay. Very well. 
What's through that? Through this door, I guess? It's locked. But don't we have a key? He was about to run through here, so I, I can't use that. That's weird. So I guess we'll go back outside. Because we still haven't found a shovel. I'm not sure whether I should have killed that guy. Probably not, but oh well. He did now. Uh, where? There's no shovels around here. Oh, there's like stuff down here, maybe. Look. Oh, I failed a survival. <laughs> so are we going to get lost or? Oh, there's like climbing happening there. Okay, they have gold and a potion of healing. That hatch is locked. I'm not really sure where else to go. Oh, there's this whole other side over here too. Okay, let's have a look at who is best at thieving stuff. Oh, what does... You have to have proficiency in thieves tools to use them, don't you? Well, it can be. Oh, okay. Well, I know I needed thieves tools to get in here. Locked. But how do I... How do I use thieves tools then? They said I needed thieves tools before. You... I can't use. Okay. Well, since I have this locket, I may as well wear it. <laughs> doesn't do anything for me. Ooh, I could change to a short sword instead of a dagger. That might be nice. Now I'm stuck. I don't know what to do. I might see if I can talk I've heard to you them? can't get blood from a stone, but apparently you can get a wizard from one. Gale seems <laughs> interesting. Interesting. We haven't gone all that far yet. What are you referring to exactly? <laughs> nah, this is not the kind of conversation I wanted to have. Okay. Oh, it's saying we need a shovel for that. These goofs ran off in like this direction, so maybe we need to go back up here somewhere. Oh, I hate this. I don't like it. Up here. Here they come. All right. Wait, there's a camp. Can't Wait, slow down. let's go back. Can't, can't slow down. Is this a campfire over here or just a regular fire? Oh, I think that's just a regular fire. Maybe we go up this way. I was hit for four fire damage? Oh my gosh. Wait, can we level up? I have to press the button. I knew we were getting XP, I didn't realize that I had to like click the level up button. Oh, more HP, that helps. Two passives, Eldritch Tomb, gain a spell, replace a spell. Okay. I think this armor one is pretty good. Eldritch Invocations. In your study of occult lore, you have unearthed Eldritch Invocations, fragments of forbidden knowledge that imbue you with an abiding magical prowess. I was going to say, is it going to tell me what these things do? Uh, agonizing Blast. When you cast Eldritch Blast, add your Charisma modifier to the damage it deals. Oh, okay. Unless it's a negative. I think I have positive Charisma. You can add cast mage armor on yourself. Mage armor increases your armor class when you aren't wearing armor. That's pretty good. Beast speech. You can speak with animals. Um, gain proficiency in deception and persuasion. Devil sight. You can see normally in darkness. 
to uh, 24 meters. That's all right. Can cast false life on yourself. Ooh, t seven temporary hit points. I assume these hit point things don't stack. Mask of many faces, disguise self. One with shadows. Repelling blast. When you hit a creature with a panel, you push the creature up to 4.5 meters away from you. Okay. I definitely think that Agonizing Blast would be one of them. Uh, I think Armor of Shadows is probably the next best thing. We'll accept those changes. So we're level two Warlock now. So <laughs> we level up Shadowheart as well. Okay. Class features, level one spell unlocked. Divinity charges. Pair spells. I think out of the ones that she has, what she's got already equipped is sufficient. But we like to have more hit points because otherwise we die. And if we die, the game is over and you have to start again. All right, this bad wizard. Time to level them up to level two. Gained two spells. Ah, oh, what spell should we give him? Okay, so he's... Ice Knife. Okay, that's pretty cool. Ooh, a magic missile is a good one too. Let's level one. Uh, 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 yeah. Sure, yeah, let's give him Magic Missile. That's a great spell. Magic Missile, I'm pretty sure you don't have to roll for attack. 3d4 damage. That's it. So, now, oh, what have we got here? Crush Spike Trap. Don't go Broken. too close. Must have been here a while. What else is up here? There's a shovel. <laughs> the shovel we've been looking for the whole time. I hear shouting overhead. Get out, but be careful. Diggy, diggy, diggy ho, diggy ho, diggy ho. Oh, what is this that we got here? Ooh, we got gold. We got amber and we got glands. Okay. Mm. He is shouting ahead. Where are people shouting? Should we go towards the shouting? Or away from the shouting? Just trying to have a look around to see if there could be anything of interest. That looks like a big ass trap. So we'll head towards it, naturally. Zoru was right. Mm -hmm. Yellow is a toad, twice as ugly. Oh, there's our friend. The thing's dangerous. Leave it for the goblins to kill. These guys escapes, are tieflings. Why are they scared of this oh, whatever she is? A guest. Your skull pounds in response to the prisoner's white hot stare. Her lips don't move, yet you hear her voice. <laughs> Get rid of her. Should I try and use deception? Let's try and use deception. We will add our guidance from our friend and hope that we roll more than a 10. And exactly. She's right. Let's go. We need to check out that blast. You didn't hear it. Shook our camp good, so we came for a look. I was the blast. 
Ooh, let's try persuasion. Ooh. We're really good at getting fifteens today. <laughs> Northwest. Look for Nettie. Whatever your wound, she can mend it. Northwest. And okay. be careful. There are goblin traps everywhere. Goblin traps, no, okay. Come. So we probably shouldn't just be running around blindly. Enough gawking. Get me down. Now, <laughs> yeah, now that they're out of your shot, sure. Are they out of your shot? So I guess. Okay, examine it to see its resistance. Oh, resistance to piercing damage, necrotic. It's vulnerable to fire. Well, that should have been, that was dumb. I should just uh, fireball the. <laughs> the tadpole has there we go. scrambled all your senses. Auspicious. Auspicious. But the longer we wait, the more it consumes. My people possess the cure for this infection. I must find a crash. You will join me. Oh, interesting. I'm wondering that exactly is a things. A hatchery, a training grounds, a shelter. Get Yankee protocol is clear. When infected with a gay tadpole, we must report to Augusto for purification. Okay. You have made an ally from Kresh Kalir. Few know such fortune. Call me Lazel. Lazel. Come. The Horned Ones mentioned a camp. One there, this Zoru, has seen Githyanki. A crash must be near. We will ask this Zoru where he has seen my kin. Okay. No one stop me yet. Oh, we better level her up as well. <laughs> Can't be having a level one with a level two party. She will die. So she is a fighter. I guess the, uh, no, she doesn't get any. She gets action surge. Gain an extra action to use this turn. Interesting. So it doesn't get anything else special, which is sad for her. She's got the most HP though. She can go in front. <laughs> All right. What do we say? Northwest. Okay. All the way up there. Okay. 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 Well, we've got to be careful of goblin traps apparently. With haste, absolutely. Wait, 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 wait a second. I just saw some loot. Dragon egg mushroom. Yes, please. And there was a short bow too. So I wonder if someone could use a short bow. Should we keep going through this way? No, no, let's go the other way. Let's go back this way. With haste. We're at a fork in the roads. Which way to go? Okay, so we've got... Oh my god. So let me know if you have any tips for what I should do next or where I should go if you've played Boulder's Gate before. Hopefully you enjoyed this episode and I look forward to seeing you at the next one.